Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new video. Are you looking to take your Wix website to the next level by customizing its design with CSS? CSS are cascading style sheets. It can help you create a unique and personalized look for your website. In this tutorial, we will show you how to custom CSS to do a custom CSS on your Wix website, including how to access the CSS editor, write your own CSS script, and much more. So, let's get started with this video. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have full experience. So, first thing first, I will need you guys to go ahead and click into the URL section, which you will have in your browsers. Then, open Wix.com, as you can see here. Now, let me just log out of my account so I can show you real quick how you can create your account and start with it. So this is the landing page that will open first when you actually first open your account or the page. So all you need to do is simply go and click on get started and it will take you to the small page section which you'll have to either choose sign in or sign up. So it is completely up to you. I will continue using my Gmail account, so I will continue with Google. Let's do that. And from here, guys, all I'm going to do is select Google and then wait for this page until it is fully loaded for me. So let's give it some time. It will not take that long for it to be actually loaded. So this is it. So it has been opened for me. So click on it. This is pretty easy, as you can see here. Now, let's give it some time and this is the page where you have to create your own website. So let me just remove one of these websites. So move to trash, move to trash and let's go ahead and create a new site. Now here you have to have, you have to answer some questions. So what kind of websites are you creating? So let's create, for example, a blog, then click on next. And then here you have to choose the website name. So let's name it tutorial because this video is just a tutorial. Now next, and finally here, there is some stuff that you want them to be in your website. So you can add them through here. For example, the blog has been built in. The chat, you can add it or remove it. The forms as well, events, portfolio, music, video, Instagram feed, pricing plans and much more you can add whatever you'd like just by choosing it and picking it just like so so for me i'm just going to keep it simple and click on next now here you'll have to start up your website so i will just click here to begin with the template and here they will take me to like some template that they have here i'm going to choose this one and then i will click on edit as you can see so now they are making the template for me, they are adjusting it so it fits what I have chosen in the previous steps. So just give it some time until it is fully loaded for you. So here it is the website guys in front of you. Now all I'm going to do simply is go ahead into the edit mode of course and then click on this left menu as you can see here. This is the menu so just go ahead and click on this add elements section from over here. Now, as you can see, you will find here a list of things from text, image, button, strip, and it, the like list has never ended. So, in our case, we are going to embed the code, so choose this one, and here's a search for the code that you are going to use. In our case, we are going to use, for example, you can embed an HTML code, you can CSS, whatever code you, you'd like to use, you can use it here. So, let me just close this real quick. All right, we can just embed the code, custom elements. So, just drag it here, upgrade your site with the premium plan. So, in that case, you'll have to actually get the premium plan from Wix. But overall, if you had like CSS code or whatever you'd like, you can actually find everything here. So you just have to click here, custom code, and simply just paste your CSS code over here. Now, the only issue that you'll have is you really have to upgrade your plan. So in order to do that, you can check their own plans. They have multiple plans from the VIP, unlimited combo, and the most basic one, which is the connect domain. And basically, the one that will help you with the CSS, it is the unlimited one. So the unlimited one, it is the one that you are looking for in case you'd like to add some CSS extra coding in your website. 
but chill let's say that you don't know anything about coding you have the uh, like the sources you have like the the plan you have the website and you'd like to add some custom css uh, code to that website well what should you do in that case should you recommend like, a programmer developer no worries guys i got you so simply just go to chat gpt or open AI and ChatGPT Chat GPT is an AI that will create literally everything. So let's say for example write me a script in CSS that allows uh, people uh, or like CSS that um, changes the color of the background of my website. So this is as simple as it. So, sir, here is an example of CSS code that changes the background of your website. So, body, background, color, and change the value of the color of your choice. Here this is another, for example, if you need, if you want to change the background color to light blue, you have to choose this code. If you like, like, or if you wanted to use a color name instead of a hexadecimal code, you could use body, background, color, light blue. So, just copy this code that will be here and then I will show you as an HTML code so let's add here add element embed code um, popular embeds and here I'm going to choose HTML and simply just paste it around here update and it will be updated unfortunately it is CSS so it is not HTML but it will work for you guys in case of course you had the premium version but overall this is what you can do using the free version well in that matter what you can do especially with the css so what you have can you do with the css feature well you can for example change stuff that you can't normally change it so let's say that normally in wix you can literally change everything but let's say that you have added so yeah let's say that you have added a code in html that allows people to sign in. So let's say here, uh, code in HTML, sign for sign in, sign up, for example. So show you here's an example. You can, for example, copy this, pretty easy. And let's, let's wait until it is finished. So here it is, you can copy it, and then we can pass it over here. Just click on update, and here you can see it has been updated now what you have to do is make it look more pretty and much better in that matter you will need the CSS code because this one you hasn't you didn't make it using works um, utilities you made it using HTML code which you have uh, created it by your own get it from somewhere it doesn't matter so in that case to make this one looks prettier you'll have to add a CSS code so write me a CSS code that helps the the HTML code that you write wrote for me looks better. So here they are. They are going to write me a CSS code that styles the sign up form to make it look better. So this is simply it. That's where you're gonna need this actual. Um, feature which is adding a CSS code to your website it is really really useful you just need to know where and when to use it specially so as you can see this is the code so simply now all you have to do is copy it go here search for the embed code and search for CSS so let's find it uh, for me I don't really have it at the moment unfortunately but for you guys you will have it so simply just go ahead and click and add it to your site and click ctrl v and everything will be good to go so i hope you guys understood everything if you had any question or any problem during this registration i hope you'll leave me like comments down below so i can have uh, a point of view of yours so i can fix whatever it takes and if you had any errors or something like that even though you had like the premium version i will make a whole new video for you guys with the premium version on it so i can give you like the specific amount of information that you will need so thank you guys for watching i hope you like this video leave a like and subscribe and see you guys in the next videos